In Columbia, South Carolina, the Gamecocks take the series over the Big Red of Cornell as they post 20 runs this weekend. They win game number two, 10 to three. Hello, everybody. I am Birch Antley along with Kip Boltonite as we show you the highlights and recap this game for you from Founders Park, South Carolina. A 10 to two win yesterday, 10 to three here today. And more good plate appearances by South Carolina's top of the order. And another great appearance by starter Thomas Farr. Yeah, Thomas Farr was outstanding. Six innings today, six strikeouts, only two walks, but only one hit given up by Thomas Farr. He was outstanding from the beginning, Birch, and a lot of good timely hitting. Jeff Heinrich just continues to be an RBI machine, and Wes Clark with another bomb today. And South Carolina had the shutout going until late in this ballgame. Cornell not scoring until late in the game in the eighth inning. But let's show you some highlights, and we will start with Thomas Farr. Yeah, Farr just commanded his fastball to both sides of the plate. He had three pitches for strikes, had a good breaking ball, really, really good changeup. But Thomas Farr just continues to impress with his execution of both sides of the plate with his fastball. It was a 1-2-3 inning to start for Thomas Farr and then setting the tone for Carolina early at the plate. It is leadoff man Noah Myers who laces a triple showing off his speed. Aggressive base running and that really just kind of set the momentum and the atmosphere here today at Founders Park for Carolina. Jeff Heinrich follows up to bring Myers in, an RBI single. He's had a few of those this weekend, has Heinrich. And then another bomb from Wes Clark here today as he just wallops that over the left field wall, a two-run home run. He's got eight home runs on the season now. We jump ahead to the third inning as Brady Allen singles into left. Heinrich comes around to score and the Gamecocks were off and running. A wild pitch brings in another Gamecock runner as South Carolina scores four times in the third inning as Colin Burgess brings in Wes Clark there. So the Gamecocks move ahead to the sixth looking for more and they will get one run in as Braylon Wimmer let off the inning getting on base courtesy of an error by the first baseman. And it's another RBI for Jeff Heinrich and South Carolina gets the win 10 to three as Josiah Seitler came in and struck out four batters to end this ball game. Farr gets the win, he is three and zero. Oh. Carolina looking for the sweep tomorrow. In Columbia for Kip Baltonites, I am Birch Hintley.